There are limitations to a CT angiogram, and so it, uh, it is not used uh, for all patients, but in the vast majority of patients it can be used, uh, and it has um, got a sensitivity of about 80 to 90 percent, which means that the information that we gain from a test, if it's positive, if it indicates a blockage, suggests that there is very likely to be a blockage on the gold standard test, which is the invasive angiogram and it's got a very high specificity, uh, which means that if it's a negative test, if the arteries are clean and don't have any coronary blockages or any coronary plaque disease, then um, we can be very sure um, with 95% certainty that um, the person does not have any major coronary disease, as if they were then being tested by a typical invasive um, coronary angiogram. So it certainly has a role to play um, in today's evaluation of patients who we suspect may have um, coronary blockages.